Hello, Nomad's Cult. Okay, in the upcoming version of Nomad's Cult 177, the next update, um, it's possible to create something like a displacement of a UV texture. Um, you need objects with a UV map. So, and here in the material menu you can apply for the opacity slot it only works with the opacity here you can choose something like a, a alpha image or yes here i'm looking for my alphas i use such a chain mail alpha and I adjust a little bit the, the scaling. <coughs> so, and here in the topology, you have to look for the reproject option. So, at the moment, here it's grayed out. So, now when you use the layer option and add a layer the reproject option is now possible it's possible it's no more grayed out so okay and the next thing is we need more topology we subdivide the mesh i only subdivide it up to 200,000 because more is not possible with a web demo and in the misc and you we press now reproject vertex from itself Zack. so uh, now something happens on the layer here when you use now the channel factors you can press now the mask button next to the channel factors and i i use the roughness um, to mask now your object is masked in the background it's yeah you can see it it's masked so now it's possible to to use this mask um, so let's delete the, the opacity and now you can see the mask here and when we use now the gizmo when the gizmo was possible okay at the moment i think there's a problem with the web demo because every every time i want to use the gizmo the gizmo is gone but um okay let's use the mask now and here in the mask options you can change your shell thickness and um, extract the mesh here so this is what you get and the more the higher the poly count the more yeah details you can have and i try here to sharpen the mask here and try it again with the extraction so here in solo view yeah but the poly count uh, of 200,000 is too too less i think we need more that's it have fun with sculpting ciao